Um, this coming week, uh, my sister uh, was taken from our home 40 years ago. Uh, we know that she is with the Lord. We grieve every day and think of her every single day. Um, we loved her then, we love her now. Um, we believe that she's with the Lord. Uh, we want to thank the Sheriff's Department for all that they've done. Uh, especially Mr. Mr. Hoffman for everything he's done. Um, we ask for your prayers, uh, keep our family in your thoughts, um, and to someone who may have some information about my sister, we ask that you come forward and give our family closure, uh, because closure is really, really all that my family wants. Uh, it's all that my family needs, and we, we pray for you. We ask that you pray for us. It is a long, old cold case of a missing person. Eva De Brule was, was uh, reported missing back in 1977. Um, it was one of those cases where the sheriff at the time, the deputies at the time, the detectives at the time put all their resources in searching uh, for her. Um, and the family even searched for her for months. Um, I went back myself a couple months ago and looked at all the old articles uh, of that uh, case from the Herald and it was one of those things where they kept searching for her for months uh, up until um, August uh, was the last article that I found but the family never stopped looking and the sheriff's office never stopped looking uh, the sad thing is we couldn't do anything until something new surfaced um, a couple of years ago um, one of the detectives here actually tried to reopen the case and interviewed a few people but those uh, interviews didn't turn up anything new uh, that could help close the case. So it is still open. Uh, if anybody has any information as to where uh, Eva Brule is or any idea of how we can finally put some closure to this case, they're asked to call us at 803-628-3059 or your County Crime Stoppers, 877-409-4321.